What's up everybody? Now, lately I've been having some trouble getting into the new Blender update, and most of it is my fault. Now, a couple weeks ago I got introduced to it and then I just started on it right away. Now, I thought learning this thing was gonna be a breeze, but it turns out that there are quite a few things that are just very different than what I'm used to. And the first thing I had trouble adjusting was the hotkeys. I tried to go through the menus and really tried to have it to where the hotkeys match the hotkeys that I have uh, in Maya. Now, of course, adjusting all these hotkeys individually is going to take some real time to do. And I don't really have that much time to sit and really work with Blender in order to get it to work the way I need it to work. Now, I know that's asking too much of a, of a piece of software that is quite different than the, you know, the one that I came from, which was Maya. But I got accustomed to the way things worked in Maya that I didn't want to change my workflow and everything to work with Blender. And I want to be able to move in between these pieces of software without having to have no real uh, transition issues. And also there's this thing sitting in the back of my head that I might just lose my, uh, my skills in Maya if I got used to, to you know, a new setup, which would be that of uh, Blender. Now these days, I don't really have the time to sit down and really watch all these tutorials and, and watch all the introduction courses and everything because I have other things going on. So I'm really trying to find a way to quickly slide into the Blender interface without having to, to you know, learn something from the, from the very beginning. But based on how things are looking, there are no shortcuts. So I'm gonna to try to see what transfers and what doesn't, then I'm gonna to try to patch it up in Blender and see what happens. Now lately I wasn't able to post any Blender related stuff cause I'm a newbie. And I don't know how that looks, you know, with me being somebody who doesn't know anything about the software and just constantly putting up videos about something that I don't really understand that well. One thing I gotta say though, the only tool that I'm able to just use and just have fun with is the sculpting uh, menu. In the sculpting panel, I can just have fun with it and just, I don't know, put on a podcast or something and just go to town on some cube and see what I can do with it. So just know that I'm really trying to slide into the new Blender 2.8 update, the beta version, especially before the official one comes out because I'm trying to be ahead of the curve. And right now on this channel, I'm going to focus more on concepts and universal things that everybody can benefit from if you're a 3D user. So that's just about it for me as far as Blender goes, and I'll be back with some more. Peace.